And now I want to uh, introduce our members of Congress who will offer a few uh, comments. And uh, first of all, we will hear from the Dean of the House, the most senior member of the House from Michigan, Congressman John Dingell. Congressman? Thank you, Mr. Secretary, and congratulations to you and the department for the fine job you're doing in administering this and a lot of other things. It's a delight to me to see a graduate of the Congress doing so well. Congratulations. And I want to say uh, to my good friend Betty Sutton, congratulations. Real leadership here. And also to my good friend Senator Carl Levin and my colleague Congressman Sandor Levin, two great members. This is a great day. It's a great step forward in seeing to it that the United States recovers and that we take care of our manufacturing sector, especially the auto industry, which, which provides one job in seven to Americans. I want to express my gratitude to Chairman Waxman, Chairman Markey, my good friend Congressman Stupak, and Inslee and, and Israel and also to my colleagues in the Senate for the outstanding way in which they have processed this legislation. And I want to commend the administration for this and for the other things that they're doing to getting America going again. This is the greatest country in the world, and we are going to see to it that it recovers and that it has the continuing economic leadership which it has shown for so long for the benefit of all Americans. I want to say that the American auto industry does face some difficulties, but the CARS Act is going to be a wonderful practical mechanism by which to achieve both consumer savings, reduce fuel consumption, lower carbon dioxide emissions, and criteria pollutant emissions. And it's going to mean increased sales for a critical sector of the American economy. We found this works in Germany and that fleet modernization programs have been a tremendous success elsewhere around the world. So let me conclude by thanking my colleagues for their collaboration on an important program, by congratulating you, Mr. Secretary, for the fine work of your department in implementing it, and to say now, by golly, we're going to make America grow. Thank you and congratulations to everyone.